welcome to Boomtown Bus. This is Tyson Lipinski, and I'm going to chronicle my life in a vanigan. So, my, my first thoughts uh, about the bus were that I was just going to use it for travel or fishing trips in the summertime. I'm an avid fly fisherman. Um, so, I was kind of thinking uh, small camping adventures at first, just kind of park it over the wintertime. But it quickly became something much more than that. I began watching a lot of um, Vanagon um, lifestyle videos and vlogs on YouTube. Uh, one of my favorite is uh, Living the Van Life. I, I've been catching up. He, uh, that gentleman has been in his van um, for over a year now and has been posting videos along the way. It, it was really an eye-opener for me. I like the idea of having that type of freedom. One thing I wanted to mention is that I am choosing to live in this van uh, and not against my will. I make very good money doing what I do for a living. Uh, I do not need to live in this van. I want to. So what are some of the things that I need to do to make my van functional as well as comfortable? Uh, a few things. Given the, the status of the season, winter time, um, especially in a cold place uh, like City, Montana, where you know you're going to be dipping down into uh, below zero, below freezing temperatures quite often, especially with the wind chill. One of the things that I need to address is first my propane or my fuel system. Uh, the second is going to be uh, the heating system. So I was able to, you know, with the these curtains and things like this, I was able to go ahead and, you know, kind of trap in a little bit of this heat. Um, you know, I. I have thought about making this my primary bed, uh, back and forth between using this as my primary bed as well as storage. Um, there's a lot of space up there that I could utilize, uh, so I really kind of have to figure that out as I go. So it's going to be a trial and error thing. So I need to get my furnace working, I need to have some way to heat this, uh, I need to be able to maintain the heat. Um, I plan on doing that by maybe insulating. There's a skylight right here. You can see some of the light coming through. Um, and I need to address storage. I want to be able to minimize the things that I have in my Vanagon um, just to make things comfortable and operate very smooth. Over the next couple weeks, I'm going to be addressing, or months rather, until the winter is over, I'm going to be addressing storage concerns, uh, solutions, and then also putting money into my van again to make sure that I have uh, a reliable form of transportation and a house. So thank you guys very much for listening to me ramble. Uh, this is Boomtown Bus, and stay tuned for my first video on maintaining and repairing my vehicle. I'm going to be messing or uh, adjusting my throttle position sensor on the, the engine to get a much smoother idle during cold startup. Thank you very much. Subscribe. Enjoy.